In Christianity, the cantor, sometimes called the presenter or the protosalts Greek, protosalts lit. First singer. From Greek, salts translate. Salts, lit. Singer. Is the chief singer, and usually instructor, employed at a church, a cathedral or monastery with responsibilities for the ecclesiastical choir and the preparation of liturgy. The cantor. S duties and qualifications have varied considerably according to time, place, and rite, and often its prestige was so high that it came close to the highest offices in the ecclesiastical hierarchy, for instance monastic cantors promoted to the office of an abbot or abbess. Sometimes the office was connected with administrative, militaric, and governmental duties the Maestro di Capella at San Marco di Venezia, even with those of a schoolteacher, as in case of the Thomascantor in charge of the Thomasschule zu Leipzig, educating a boy's choir that served four churches. Generally a cantor must be competent to choose and to conduct the vocals for the choir, to start any chant on demand, and to be able to identify and correct the missteps of singers placed under him. He may be held accountable for the immediate rendering of the music, showing the course of the melody by movements of the hands charinomia, similar to a conductor. <laughs> Eastern Christianity in the Eastern Orthodox, Oriental Orthodox, and Eastern Catholic Churches, a cantor, also called a chanter, Greek, salts translate. Salts, lit. Singer. Church Slavonic, pivik translate. Pivots, is a monk or a lay person in minor orders who chants responses and hymns in the services of the church. There are several titles for the salts, which depend on the recognition of his capabilities as a chanter, sometimes connected with an employment, by the local or ecumenical patriarchate. In some smaller communities it is also possible, that the community sings within an oral tradition and without any instruction by a protosalts. In other orthodox rites, there are various hierarchical offices, which can be passed during a long career, connected with a lifelong process of learning. <laughs> Byzantine tradition Particularly in the Byzantine tradition, the cantor in charge of doing the music for a service is referred to as the protosalts gr. protosalts a term which may also refer to an office within a diocese or whole jurisdiction see domesticos, but this title was not used before the 12th century. The cantor or chanters sing the many hymns called for during the divine services and the divine liturgy. A chanter must be knowledgeable about the ecclesiastical modes as well as the complex structure of the services. At Constantinople the charge of a protosalts was prestigious and connected with Byzantine offices. In the tradition of the cathedral rite at Hagia Sophia, there was a distinction between the leader of the right choir domesticos and the leader of the left choir lampadarios. Still during the last centuries, the usual career was to start after serving as protosalts of other cathedrals as the second domesticos of the great church who assisted the first, then to proceed in the office of the teacher, and later even to the lampadarios, who often replaced the left choir as a soloist called monophonaires, see Contacarian, and finally this career was sometimes continued by the promotion to the protosalts or archon salts archantes salti of the great church of the ecumenical patriarchate. Topic. Vestments in Orthodox rites Topic. In the Greek tradition, a chanter will often wear the exorison, a black outer cassock with angel wing sleeves. The Slavic tradition, which tends more commonly to use a choir rather than a cantor, assigns no specific vestment to the chanters, unless an individual has been ordained a reader, in which case he would wear only the inner cassock and put on the stitcharion when he receives Holy Communion. In the Greek tradition, the chanters are stationed at a psalterion, a chanting podium positioned to the south and sometimes also to the north side of the sanctuary. In the Slavic tradition, the chanters are similarly positioned, and the area is referred to as the kleros. Western Christianity Topic Topic Roman Catholicism Topic Before and after the Second Vatican Council in the Roman Catholic Church a cantor was the leading singer of the choir a bona fide clerical role The medieval cantor of the papal Shola Cantorum was called Prior Sholai or Primicerius 
In medieval cathedrals, the cantor or precentor directed the music and chant, and was also one of the ranking dignitaries of the chapter. During the 14th century in many churches, the cantor began to delegate his instruction of the singers to a master of music. After the introduction of harmonized music, some duties naturally fell to the conductor or choirmaster. Today, the cantor is a role that can be performed by a lay person. In parishes without a choir, the cantor serves to lead the responsorial singing with the congregation. The cantor's locality in the church is most generally to the right of the choir, and directly to his left is his assistant, formerly called the sixcenter. A common custom for cantors was the bearing of the staff, which was the mark of his dignity and a visual representative of his sacred role inside the church. This custom still survives in some places. Topic. Protestantism Topic. In Protestant churches the role of the cantor can be lay or pastoral. In northern European cities, especially in Germany, the title of cantor or cantor survived the Reformation, and referred to a musician who supervised the music in several principal churches, taught in the boys' secondary school, and provided music for civic functions. Johann Sebastian Bach Thomas Cantor in Leipzig and Georg Philipp Telemann Hamburg were among the famous musicians employed under this system. In cathedral churches in the Anglican Communion, the precentor or head cantor is a member of the governing chapter, second in rank to the dean. His stall is opposite the dean's, and the two sides of the divided choir are accordingly known as decani dean's, and cantoris precentor's. See also Topic Anglican Church music Contemporary Catholic liturgical music Gregorian chant Mass music Topic References Topic Topic Studies Topic. Moran, Neil K. 2002. Byzantine Castrati. Plain Song and Medieval Music. 11 02 99 112. doi 10 1017 S0961137102002073. Moran, Neil K. 2005. The Choir of the Hagia Sophia. Orion's Christianus, 89 1 7. Wolfram, Gerda. 1995. Der Byzantinische Chor, We Er Sich in den Typica Day 10, minus 12. J. H. Darstelt. PDF. Budapest, Hungarian Academy of Sciences. pp. 397 402. ISBN 9637074546. This article incorporates text from the public domain Catholic Encyclopedia of 1913. The Catholic Encyclopedia, 1913 Cantor, Miriam Webster Cantor Topic. External links Topic. Byzantine Music, Archon Cantors of the Great Church of Christ. Biographies and recordings of important salts of the Constantinopolitan Patriarchate. Istanbul, Ecumenical Patriarchate. 2004 to 2009 retrieved the 9th of September 2012 Kokosalis John the 13th of December 2006 John Kokosalis Teratismos sung by ensemble Romeco in historic costumes National Library of Athens Romeco ensemble retrieved the 24th of September 2012